All right, I'm here again with Barbara, and Barbara, we're gonna do another observational drawing. Um, and I thought I'd ask you, hey, hey, you gotta stay here. Just stay here for a little bit, okay? Please? Okay, oh. All right, well, Barbara's gone, so I got Bob here. And uh, hey, Bob, would you help me uh, figure out what we should do in observational drawing? Okay, let's try this one more time. So Bob's gonna help me uh, figure, Okay, Barbara, Bob, we'll just try and do this from a distance. Uh, number one, do you think I should do a drawing of a mouse? Bob, you like that one? Barbara, not so much? Well, that could be a little complicated for my, uh, for my students. So let's start with something a little bit easier. How about um, a can of cat food? I'm sure you like that, Barbara. Yeah, Barbara likes that. Bob, that's not your food? Okay, well, Let's think of something else then. How about a uh, cat leash? I'm just kidding, I would never do that to you. I know you hate cat leashes. What do you think about a paper towel roll? Okay, that works for both of you? All right, works for me too. All right, we got the approval from Bob and Barbara to draw this paper towel tube. But before we start drawing this tube, we need to decide how we're going to draw this tube. Meaning, how are we going to be looking at it? Are we going to be looking at it straight on like this, how it looks like a circle inside of a bigger circle? Are we going to be looking at it from the side like this, where it almost looks like a rectangle? Or are we going to be looking at it at an angle where you can see that it's open on one side and very long? Let's study this paper towel tube and then we'll start our observational drawing. What you see now is a picture of the paper towel tube from the same angle that I will be drawing it from. Let us first study and observe, almost like scientists, the details of this object before we begin drawing. I first want to note that it is very tall. It is not very wide, but it is very tall. At the top of this tall object is an opening from this angle, the opening looks like an oval shape. There are six faded white stripes going around this object, spaced equal distance apart from one another. There are also lines moving diagonally across the object. There are two of them on the side that I can see, almost like candy cane stripes. These lines are very thin and darker. It is mostly all light brown, but I can see that the left side looks like a darker brown and the right side looks like a lighter brown. I can see from the inside at the top that there is actually lighter brown on the left side and darker brown on the right side. Let's begin to draw.
All right, and there it is, my paper towel tube drawing. Now, it took me about eight minutes to create in all, so with whatever it is you decide to draw, try and sit down with it for at least five or 10 minutes and really take your time as you study and observe and create all that detail that you can see. Um, don't be hard on yourself. If things don't look exactly like you want them to, don't worry. We are all learning. I'm still learning. You're still learning. And number one thing is to create, explore, and have fun. So I can't wait to see what you drew. Good luck. Bob. Uh-oh. Bob.